Hey everyone, welcome to the Burnt Brass Homestead channel. Uh, this is the area where I started the bee garden, so we'll see how it looks um, during the spring. As you can see, the plants that were planted are kind of dying off now. The black eye Susan and the, I uh, forget the name, the cone plant, uh, they're kind of like dead, but hopefully the roots are established and they'll come back next year, as well as the um, as well as the, uh, the bulbs that I planted. So I planted bulbs on each side, so I'm, I'm hoping they come up during the spring. And then also what I wanted to show you guys is our beehive. So one of my neighbors called me who keeps bees, and they said that a lot of their bees were dead. Um, in front of the entrance of the beehive. So, what she believes is that someone sprayed pesticides somewhere and the bees brought them back. Because as you can see, um, this beehive is still active. So, there's nothing wrong with this beehive. It has some dead bees in front of it. This one um, is a younger smaller colony so I'm concerned about that I'm not going to take the lid off uh, we just got back from a trip so I haven't had a chance to get in here so I'll probably look at this on um, maybe Sunday take a look inside but as you can see there are a lot of dead bees in there and even though it's fall and the temperatures are dipping into the 40s it still isn't that cold to cause this. So she believes that someone sprayed some pesticides in the area and it resulted in um, the bees bringing it back and and this is the way the hive um, looks. So unfortunately, I'm not sure um, what to expect on Sunday. I'm not gonna open it up now because I don't have time. As you can see in the background, the sun is going down. So this is the first chance that I've had to take a quick glance at this. And she did send me pictures uh, when we were away. So, yeah, I'm not really sure what to expect here. But the only thing I can do is if this hive on the right here is totally dead, then I just have to start over next spring that's that's the best that I can do my intentions were to split to learn how to split the hive to grow the co colony without having to purchase bees all the time so you know that's that's something that I want to learn how to do um, but unfortunately I don't really think um, I'm gonna have the opportunity to do that with um, with these hives so we'll see. I'll give you guys an update, but I do thank you for supporting this channel. Please like, share, and subscribe to help this small channel to grow.